Hi guys, Nate Dodder here. Welcome to another unboxing video. This is a new unboxing, a new company I've used. This is a company called Comic Chaos. And obviously by the name you can tell they're going to uh, supply comics. But yeah, this is a, a new company. I've done comic unboxings before, but this is the first one from this company. Um, yeah, so let's uh, let's dive in. I've already undertaken the, uh, taken the sellotape off it, so it was a bit of a nightmare to get into. But as you can see here, I am blessed with a rather abundant selection of jelly beans. They use uh, they use jelly bellies, jelly beans, as their their packing material, which is rather fantastic. So if you get some of these comics, you will get um, some jelly beans, which is awesome. So uh, as I've said on previous videos that I've done, they're one of my favourites. So that is brilliant. I will just rather noisily empty those all out. I've got tons of 20, 30 odd different packets of. Uh, Jelly beans, brilliant, thank you for those, that's, that's awesome. Right, so what you get here um, is 16 comics. You can order from Comic Chaos in 16 or um, 32, I think, or 33 comics you get in a, in a pack, 30, 16 or 32, I think. Um, the 16 comics cost £18.49 in the UK with free shipping. Um, they also ship internationally, but you can check their website out. I'll leave the link to the website at the bottom of the screen now so you can uh, you can check out their website and have a look. Um, you order. Not like other unboxings I've done where you you order during the month and then at the end of the month they send you the parcel at the end of each month. This is, if you order today, they'll be shipped within the next couple of days and be with you within a week, so it's kind of instant shipping. Um, yeah, you get you get 16 comics for £18.49. Um, and uh, yeah, we've got a good selection. They all come, um, they all come with uh, the, the kind of protective um, sort of wallet and a board card back which is good so they keep them nice and in good condition so let's go through them um, let's have a look this first one is um, is Captain Marvel brilliant nice nice bit of um, art on the front yeah Captain Marvel a Marvel comic obviously so let's uh, that's that one next one is Battle Tide it's got like a, a foil if you can see that on the camera but a foil kind of logo which is quite good quality issue one of four what's the date on that one does it say 1993, yeah, so they're, they're good, good comics. Um, if you look at the website, you'll see they kind of do a mixture of, um, of rare um, comics as well as new and old ones, but some, some of the old ones obviously aren't rare, but they do rare ones. Um, sometimes they can be over £100 worth of value, apparently, um, which, is, which is good for, for a, sort of just under £20. So if you collect comics, it's always a good, uh, a good, a good buy, I think. So that's Battle Tide. The next one is Heavy Hitters Law Dog. Interdimensional Highway Patrolman. That's issue one. That is um, Epic Comics. Um, so it's not just Marvel. We do Marvel, DC, um, Dark Horse comics, all different, all different types of makes. So if you've got any kind of special comics that you like, it's worth probably getting in contact with them. Um, I'll put the links for Twitter and for Facebook on the page on the screen as well, and they'll also be in the description. Um, to maybe, I'm not sure if they can sort of cater for everyone's needs, but if you've got a comic you particularly like, you like, you like Captain America, for example. Um, it might be worth saying, and they might be able to put a couple of those in each time for you, so I don't know. Um, but let's, uh, let's have a look at this. This is Captain America issue number one, yeah. First spectacular issue, this is from uh, November 96. So that's rather cool. That's brilliant. Green Arrow, I like the Green Arrow. Um, let's some of these before. This is issue two. That's brilliant. Issue two of the Green Arrow. Oh, and we've also got issue three there. Issue three of the Green Arrow as well. So there's a couple of consecutive issues here. This is... Uh, Cross Gen, um, Skion, Skion, issue 37. Spectacular, apparently the uh, comic, the comment at the top of the comic there. Um, this is a, oh, this is a manga one, uh, Dark Horse Comics manga edition, um, Dominion, like the Japanese style of artwork. So that's quite cool. That's uh, brilliant. Have a look at that one later. Body bags. This is a bit dark. It's got a lot of blood and guts on the front. That's a bit more of an adult theme. But yeah, brilliant. So I'm sure if you're if you're a parent and you want to buy some of these for your children, um, again probably get in contact with them and say you want to keep it to more the kind of um, younger audience type comics, maybe the Captain Americas and the Hulks and the Spider-Man ones, because obviously that's a bit more suited to the age range of the children perhaps. But um, if you're older, if you're older than like me, then uh, it doesn't really matter what you get. Um, another Sion issue 35 here. Oh, and I've got issue 36. So we've actually got 35, 36, and. 37 of the same comic here so again whether that's um, a coincidence whether they've actually put that in post for me like that for that running order I don't know but that's really good so we've got three three issues in a row there the devil's footprints that one looks a bit more uh, 
of a uh, more mature audience as well. It's like a bit of a bit of a zombie on the front of that on the front of that one, hanging upside down. That's a good Dark Horse comic. Oh, Captain America. Is that right? yeah that is, that's another Captain America. I'm not sure if that's the same as the other one. That was issue one as well. Looks like that's issue one at the bottom there. That's a different different range. Which is really good. Another Captain America, issue three. You're doing your part, yes. Spider-Man, ah, Spider-Man's one of my favourites. This is, looks like quite an old one. The uh, date on the front of the, uh, the drawing on the front is 89. I think this looks like it's a 1990 issue. Issue 330, so comics uh, from Spider-Man have been going on for a long, long while. That's brilliant. And the last one is uh, Cyber Force, issue 3. Um, drawing on the front there, the date says 93, so it's around about that time that that comic came out. Like I said, they're all nicely protected, in good, good condition. So uh, yeah, that's it. Um, like I said, go to um, comic-chaos.co.uk, um, the link's on the screen, but you can check out their website, um, contact them on Twitter and on Facebook, and uh, yeah, that's it. So yeah, thanks for watching guys, hope you've enjoyed. Oh, one thing to say actually, if you do get um, comics from them, if you take a picture of your of your your your, your delivery, of the comics you've got, post it onto their Twitter page or onto their Facebook page, um, and I think they choose, if not everyone, some of you that do that will get four extra comics in the next uh, in the next box that you order so that's well worth doing um, yeah well worth checking out I'm really impressed with those I think I've been I think got a good selection there so I'll probably do that again in a future future month and um, get some more do another video but yeah for now guys I've been Say Doctor and we will see you again soon thanks for watching bye bye